What's going on guys, S.Bell MMA here with another Evolve MMA sparring session uh, for Muay Thai here with Anthony. Uh, as we get going, um, I will say, uh, you'll see throughout this, he was probably one of the best uh, boxers that I went, went against. So uh, a lot of their Muay Thai guys have good kicks, but their their boxing isn't great. But uh, I would uh, throw shots and he would he would come back and counter pretty well there. You see he lends a leg kick. He was using, you know, there he's using his jab. Uh, to kind of gauge distance and kind of keep me at bay, uh, which was uh, interesting to see. So I, w I was curious if he had um, a prior boxing background uh, because a lot of the guys there, you see, you would definitely see they, they like their kicking, but their their boxing wasn't great. But he was using his both his kicks and his strikes, and he had really good timing, and he looked like he was one of the more experienced guys to go against. So I had a lot of fun with this one there. You see I'm able to check the, the kick he's going for. And with me, my even when I'm doing Muay Thai, uh, I kind of use a regular kickboxing kind of movement. So you see I'm kind of moving back and forth. And you guys know how I am there. You see I'm able to catch his foot and then land a leg kick. Uh, so for me, I'm not uh, staying as stationary as a, a regular Muay Thai fighter would. Uh, or, you know, ha have the front foot bounce. So here, you see I faint. I go, he goes for another push kick. I'm able to push that. I push the second one again, I catch it, and then land another leg kick. But you see he comes back with a, a, a jab that, that lands uh, there. He goes for another push kick. He kicks again, and I'm able to check that. And for me, uh, making sure, you know, I'm checking a lot of kicks just so, to keep it in the person's mind that they should, you know, be a little bit more hesitant. You see I faint in there to kind of see, and he, he was quick to react. He definitely had very good reaction time as well. There he goes for another kick. I'm able to check that. Uh, and then my thinking was, as I'm checking, I'm checking just to kind of get his timing and see how he reacts after I check. There, the, I land a right a right that lands clean uh, after. So I land a one-two. Then I start using my jab a little bit more. I land an inside leg kick, and then he comes back with a kick of his own, but I'm able to block that with my elbow. There, I land a, a, another right cross that lands clean. And here he's trying to use that push kick to keep me at bay. I use mine uh sidekick but it he blocks it down so it, it lands a little bit low uh there you see i'm using my jab at, at, as a feint and kind of gauge distance and then i try to go for another inside leg kick um and again i like to switch stances uh to kind of just throw people off and because uh you know i like to work from both sides this is a, a result of being left-handed and uh, working with capoeira and even with capoeira uh, we kick and everything from both sides. So you see there, he kind of put gets a lands a kick that pushes me back a little bit. There, I, I was able to land a kick. He catches it, but I'm able to get out of there. And so this this match was uh, uh what probably one of my favorites. Uh, we both there, we both throw a kick and uh we bump we bump knees there as we we're throwing uh both of our uh roundhouses there. There you see him able to land another right. Uh, he's landing a push kick, kind of trying to keep me at bay. Uh, there he lands a higher kick, but I'm able to kind of block that. And then I land a, a one to the body and then a, a right to the face. And then again, I'm like using my jab to kind of get in there and then setting up that right hand. Uh, and again, you'll see in a lot of my videos, I'm much more of a boxer than I am a kicker. I'll throw my kicks as kind of setups for my punches. Uh, but for me, I'm, I'm usually landing strikes and... Uh, I'm I'm definitely more confident in my my punching power and my landing ability with my punches as opposed to my kicks. And I'll definitely land my kicks, but they may not necessarily land with enough power there. Catch me with a leg kick that uh, kind of throws me down, and then the round ends. Thank you guys again for watching. If you like what you saw, please subscribe. Thanks.